POV, point of view. A POV shot is a film technique that shows the audience what a character sees and experiences, as if the viewer is looking through their eyes. POV shots are often used to immerse the audience in the story, making them feel like they are part of the action and show things they might not otherwise see. So if you're looking for a way to level up your videos using POV shots with your iPhone, you've probably done some research and come across some creative, maybe even wonky or expensive solutions on YouTube. For example, check out this video by Kony Wainer. He makes a really slick looking helmet contraption, but it costs $64 and require some tools to build it. And honestly, it does look kind of silly. I would recommend going this method if A, you don't mind looking a little bit crazy and- I applaud his creativity, but I'm not interested in spending that kind of money or looking that silly in public. He also suggests another method where you stick a pop socket on the back of a phone. Not here. Put the pop socket right in your mouth. I got it. That's, like, that's how you get in the Oh yeah. Oh. But that's kind of gross. Again, cool idea, but putting the pop socket in your mouth limits your ability to speak and narrate what you're doing in the moment. So what kind of product are we actually looking for then? Well, we need a solution that allows us to be hands-free. It's really difficult to try and do something when you've got one hand tied to the camera. We also don't want something that's going to make us look too silly, especially for filming in public. We also need the ability to talk out loud and narrate what's happening in the moment. And lastly, we need something affordable. I think I have something that will work. This is the magnetic neck mount from a company called Telesyn. And all the clips you saw at the beginning of this video were filmed on my iPhone using this neck mount. Okay, so how does this thing work? First, you need to detach the gooseneck from the central base pad. Then you wrap it around your neck and simply reinsert it back into the base pad. Next, attach your iPhone to the magnet and hit record. Boom, it's that simple. Now the secret sauce here is the super strong magnet attached to the base pad. So that means you'll need a mobile phone or a mobile case that comes with MagSafe. Now I've tested out this device in a variety of different scenarios. So I want to make you aware of a few things because this device won't work for every situation. Tip number one, don't look at the phone. When I first got the device and decided to make a cappuccino at the house, I found myself looking at what I was doing through the phone. And the problem is the phone is so close to your face, eventually it made my eyes kind of wonky and watery, and it was really difficult to see. So here's what I did to fix that, which worked much better. First thing I did was set the zoom distance on the phone to 0.5. Then I hit record, and then I positioned the camera as close and as high to my body as possible. Now the camera is no longer in my field of view and I can clearly see what's in front of me or what my hands are holding or what I'm doing. I feel like this is a better way to use it than trying to look through the phone. Tip number two. This is a great tool for simple things like walking and talking, but I don't think it's really meant for extreme sports. I don't think you could use this for things like snowboarding, mountain biking, or even running. Let's see what it looks like with me running. Oh, I'm nervous. I'm nervous about the phone falling off. I'm gonna put my hands here to catch the phone in case it falls. Oh man, that's horrible. It's like, so, <laughs> that's horrible footage. I will say the magnet is super strong. And recently I was in Alaska riding on ATVs and the magnet did a great job of keeping the phone attached. It did not fall off. However, I was worried about it falling off the entire time. The good news is Telson does include a safety rope which attaches to your phone case. So if you are worried about it falling off, you can use the safety rope. Additionally, they also offer another version of this neck mount that comes with a chest strap that does provide additional stability and support. Tip number three, it does allow you to rotate for vertical shooting, which is great for reels, TikTok, and YouTube shorts. Tip number four, it can actually stand on its own and mount to different environments as well. This allows you to set it up and look straight at the camera for vlogging or filming yourself doing some activity. It's not really meant to be used that way, but it is a bonus feature. Tip number five, it doesn't seem to work too well for POV driving. I tried using it in two different vehicles and it just sits too low to see over the steering wheel. So who is this product for? 
I think this is a great tool for content creators, bloggers, or mobile filmmakers. You can use this for unboxing videos, what's in my gear bag videos, traveling, and like I mentioned before, light exercise like walking. So does this tool check all the boxes? Can I operate it hands-free? Yes. Does it make us look silly? No. Can we talk freely? Yes. Is it affordable? Yes. At the time of this recording, it retails at $29.99. If you'd like to pick one up, I'll put a link to it in the description below. Okay, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.